Hey everyone, I pray this message finds you and yours well. I hope you had an amazing Easter just celebrating the resurrection of Jesus. Obviously that's something we can celebrate every day. Uh, so full transparency, I have a confession. On Easter, after our online service, my family had ordered a good Easter lunch from a local restaurant and they scheduled pickup time slots. So I showed up at our designated time only to find a line of cars and a very, very unorganized process for pickup. My 11.45 pickup time turned into 12.30 by the time I received my food. Uh, for probably 20 minutes, I was in my car. I was frustrated, blood pressure probably rising, uh, me mentally telling them how to efficiently run their business. I knew that my food was gonna be cold and it wasn't a cheap meal, right? This is, this is Easter lunch and I was mad. And then God's spirit just began to speak to me. These people are struggling. Uh, they might be shorthanded as many can't or aren't able to find work. You need to show grace in the same way that I've shown you grace. Love your neighbor as yourself. It's easy in this time to become frustrated, to see things and, and wanna set people straight or, or react in anger towards someone. The reality is you, you don't know what someone's going through or what's going on behind the scenes. All of us are just trying to get through this. And my goal is to be Jesus to people as much as possible. So let's be prayed up daily, in the word daily, prepared for whatever life throws us, and let's treat people with grace and love the same way that God has treated us. Let me pray for us. God, we thank you for your graces and the love that you've showed us right now. It's easy to get frustrated, but Father, we wanna be like you. We wanna show your love, especially to those who are hurting, those who are just trying their best in a difficult situation. God, continue to transform our hearts to be more like yours. In Jesus' name, amen. Hey, before I leave, let me just remind you how important it is to be connected with other believers, uh, socially distant, but relationally connected. I know a lot of our life groups are getting together on Zoom calls. If you're not part of a group, let us know. We'll connect you with other people. We definitely wanna stay connected during this time. I just want you to know we love you guys. We're thankful uh, for you and for your faithfulness. Uh, God is good. We're all gonna get through this and we're gonna get through it together. Love you, God bless.